this is a little bonus video, uh, just adding on to the script we just wrote. This is part of a series. Uh, hopefully, I remember to put an annotation on the screen or a link in the in the uh, description of this video to the full playlist. And you're going to want to watch uh, definitely at least the video right before this one, which was released on the same day. Um, and it is going to give us the majority of our code here. We're just going to add a little bit. As you can see, we have a Google Map here and the marker is moving and the map is following that marker. So let's go ahead and look at the code. And again, if you watched last video, almost all this code is the same. We've got our initialize function, our location where we start, the loading of the map after the page loads. But what we've added here is this function called move marker, and we're calling it here at the end of our initialize script. And um, we're passing it which map and which marker we want to affect, because you can have more than one map and you can have more than one marker in an application. And here we're going to say set interval. In JavaScript this is how you set intervals. You have something loop continuously at a certain uh, amount of time in intervals. Uh, here we're saying 500, which means half a second. So every half a second we're going to move the marker and pan our map. So again, we've created a map, placed a marker at a location, and now we're going to say, okay, every time it loops, every half a second, we're going to take X and we're going to add 0 .0001 to it. And for Y, we're going to subtract 0 .001 from that location. Now we're going to say, to create a variable called center and or replace our variable that we've already created called center and replace it with those coordinates. And we're running that through the Google Maps latitude longitude function here to get the right formatting for it. And we're gonna say, okay, our marker, we're going to set its position to the center, our new center, and we're gonna set our map, we're gonna to pan to center. So every half a second, what it's gonna do is it's going to move the marker that 0 0.0001 degrees in coordinate in both X and Y positions, and then it's going to pan the map to that location. That's exactly what's going on here. So we're gonna get that steady upward left movement. And again, this is um, very simple. I'm just showing you a very basic thing that's moving the marker on the map, but you can move them to specific locations. You can say, uh, you know, move the marker to this address, or these coordinates and then pan the map to it. It could be in another state or another country and that will work as well. So I just want to show you how to set that in intervals just to again make the marker move. A little bonus video. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're enjoying this series. Be sure to check them all out. There should be a link to the full playlist. As always, if you like this video, be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Visit my website, Films by Chris. That's Chris with a K dot com. I'll link to that in the description as well. And I hope that you have a great day. Okay, this is an introduction to filmsbychris.com. I'm Chris, that's Chris the K. That's me right there. My daughter Ember, and my wife Jennifer. We pretty much live in the swamps of Florida. I'm a firefighter by day, as well as by night. We work long hours. But that's not why you're here. You're here about the videos I put up on YouTube. These videos are mainly about computers and programming, which means most of my videos look something like this. And if that's what you're interested in, great. If not, that's all right. I do videos on other topics too, such as video editing, special effects, photo editing, 3D design, and music creation. If you are one of my viewers and you enjoy my videos, my Patreon page is a place where you can go to help support my videos. So I ask that you take the time to go to my Patreon page and look at the different levels of rewards you can receive for different levels of backing. There should be a link in the description of this video if you are watching it on YouTube. Otherwise, you can visit patreon.com forward slash metalx1000. And I thank you for your time and your support. Have a great day.